There are more than 5,000 homeless children in Marion County alone. A local organization is now working to break the cycle of homelessness through education. Schools on Wheels works with kids in 80 different schools throughout the Indianapolis area. And our Sarah Jones got a chance to check out the program, which sends tutors to homeless kids. Yeah. Little ones who attend the weekly tutoring sessions Not like say it's fun. I don't know what kind of sentence I can write. They spelled it, did I write it. And what does accomplishment feel like for a six-year-old? Happy. Camila remembers that feeling. Now a volunteer, she was once a student here. Before, I was an honor roll student. And then her grades began to slip. My mom was actually in an abusive relationship that we had to leave. They sought refuge in a shelter. At that point, my number one priority is making sure that I'm fine. Like, I don't care about learning right now. Camila's mom made her attend school on wheels. It felt like I had one person other than my mom because I thought she was the only person that cared about me to actually help me reach my goals and who I wanted to be as a student. Giving her the confidence to get back on track. After that, I was like, school is important and I'm going to pass and I'm going to graduate, which I did. Restoring her pride in her accomplishments. And the program says she's not alone. During the 2018-19 school year, 98% of the kiddos in our program who attended the duration of the school year tutoring, they were promoted to the next grade. That statistic is staggering, considering homeless kids are 87% more likely to discontinue their education. Camila now wants to be a teacher. I want to be the person that I had. School on Wheels says education is the key to breaking the cycle of homelessness. And their goal is to be there when children need them the most. In Indianapolis, Sarah Jones, Channel 13, Eyewitness News. School on Wheels has a uniform drive right now, and they are accepting donations. But they tell us what they really need is more volunteers. So if you'd like to help out, we've placed a link where you can sign up with this story tonight. Just check on WTHR.com.